what's up you guys this is Seth Grogan and I am coming to do a messy side bun video I guess and I joined Tracy's um, bun challenge and that consists of wearing a bun or protective style Monday through Friday and then on the weekends you can do whatever you like so I decided to try that out and see how that's going to turn out for my hair. Because um, lately I've been wearing it out a lot and trying these different styles and all that. And it's just becoming a little too much for me. Um, I really don't do a lot of manipulations in my hair. Um, that's why I was wearing the wigs and stuff like that. But, you know, it's time for something different, you know. Um, as that saying goes, if you do what you've always done, then you will get what you've always gotten. So, I figured, you know, if I do something different, then maybe I'll get some different results. So, that's what I'm going to do. And I decided to go with a side bun, kind of messy bun. Um, so, I just want to show you that. And this is the result still of the flat iron that I did. Um, I hadn't put any more heat since I've done that. On that, I just tie it up at night and, take, you know, take it down in the morning. I would not curl it or nothing. I just let it, let it do what it wants to do. So I just put it in a side ponytail. And so that my edges won't look like a chia pet, I put some aloe vera gel. And I hadn't used gel on my hair, y'all, in almost like three years, like for real. But I decided to go with the aloe vera gel, and I just put it on my edges only. Like I said, it, it looks a hot mess on those edges. I ain't with that. So I did that. I didn't put it like throughout the hair. I just did just on the edges only. And I did leave a piece out in the front here. Um, and I'm going to put a large Caruso roll on this just to give us some curl. But here's the, here's the messy bun. And some of it came out. But what I did after I put it in the, the ponytail, I moisturized with the silk and child and sealed with the coconut oil. I mean, not coconut oil. I use castor oil. Just regular castor oil. Um, and um, sealed my ends with that. And I just took some of the hair and using some bobby pins. And took the hair in no uniform way and just pull it up and pin it with the bobby pin. And it's some few stragglies, but I like that. It makes it look a little messy. Just spit it up like that. And there's no fillers or any extra hair or anything like that in this. This is all mine. All my hair. And um, this is it. So I think I might start doing maybe... Um, like a, uh, and I, I just take it and kind of fluff it out and make it a little bit bigger. I don't know if you guys can see that. That is all my hair. It looks big. But anyway, um, like I said, I'm going to take this and put a Caruso roller in it for about maybe 10 to 15 minutes. And it will have a little curl to it. And that's it. This is my bun. It may not be perfect, but like I said, that's the look I'm going for. But, um, and you see that fuse hanging down, but that's cool. Just take it and pin it up. But those other stragglers, you can leave that out. Well, that's how the, that's how I want mine to look. But anyway, and at night, I'm going to just tie it up. But like I said, I might start doing maybe a French braid. Just wear one French braid going straight down or a bun that just tucked under or... Something like that. I'm going to start doing that. And this challenge, I think, is for six months. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. So you guys need to go to KISS and see it back for details. Yourself. But I think it's for six months. I'm not really sure. And I'm not sure how long I'm going to last by doing that. But I'm going to go as long as possible. I think that's a great, great challenge. Um, so at night, I'm just going to tie it up. And what I'll do is this bang, I guess, or whatever, this little side piece right here. I just take it, put it behind my ear, take my long satin 
scarf. It's not the uh, square ones. It's the long ones. And um, tie it up and put this under the ponytail. And I want to give a big shout out to the, one of the sisters. I don't know your name, darling, but you said that I was loud in my videos. Big shout out to you for keeping it 100 because I am loud. And I was going to ask y'all, do y'all have to turn y'all volume down on y'all videos before <laughs> Before y'all listen to me, because I know, I don't know, I listen to my own. Oh, you know how you go back and make sure everything is on the up and up, and I have to turn that volume down every time. Like, dang, I'm loud. But I'm loud all the time. Even my boss told me I was loud. It's like, you're very good at what you do. You're, you're just really loud. That's how it always has been. Uh, I know, I guess growing up, instead of me and my mama coming to each other's face to talk, we would holler across the house. That's how we have our conversation. So I guess it just grew on me just to talk loud. But a uh, big shout out to you. It's all good. No harm done. I know I'm loud. So if it's irritating anybody, just turn that volume down before y'all watch the videos and y'all be straight. Okay? Um, But that's it. And you see that the bun is still out. And I'm going to just take my satin bonnet and just put it over that. And that's it. So my hair is fully protected. But that's my messy side bun. And I'm going to try to do a uh, protective style once a week, so maybe I'll do a video, um, like when I do my French braid or something like that, and I want to thank all of my subscribers, all of my supporters, y'all, y'all be keeping it real, you know what I'm saying, I, I really like that about y'all, you know what I'm saying, I feel like I know y'all, it's real crazy how communication can make you feel close to a person that you've never met. But I feel really close to a lot of you guys. I really would love to meet a lot of y'all. And I don't know. It's just real, real comforting. And um, I really, really appreciate it. Everything. I really, really do. And I'm going to say this because um, I've been getting some messages. I'm going to just put this out there. I'm not on here for a popularity contest. Um, I'm not on here to get fame or fortune. I'm not on here... Uh, for any other objective than to grow my hair out and document what's working for me and kind of share some tips of what I found that works for me and hopefully it helps you out. I'm not a hair expert. I'm not going to come at you and talk at you or talk down at you like I know all about hair and that this is, you know what I'm saying? I, I don't know. I'm, I'm still learning like y'all still learning. So if I don't know, I'm going to find out. But I'm not going to come on here acting like I already know what time it is. I don't know, y'all. So this is just me documenting and hoping that what I've learned will help you guys too. So again, you guys, thank you for everything. Thank you for all your support. I hope y'all like my side bun, my side messy bun. And I want you guys to continue to pray for me. I will definitely pray for you guys. I love you so much. Thank you to all my subscribers and supporters. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.